Hey guys, what's going on? Joe with Lone Wolf Paintball, and today I'm going over the live pepper ball rounds and our new home defense options we've got added to the website. All right, guys, so sitting in front of me are the live SD pepper ball rounds. Uh, these are available now uh, for consumers like us. Um, it's a non-lethal uh, home defense option, um, so these won't kill anybody, but they will definitely stun them, definitely stop them in their tracks, definitely make them start sneezing, coughing, uh, having a really, really adverse affection. So uh, I'm going to go over uh, how these work today, go over some of the home defense kits, and then uh, we're definitely going to do a separate shooting video outside where we shoot these. You can kind of see the cloud and hopefully we'll have a volunteer to uh, take a hit and we'll see how it reacts. So if you want to volunteer, let us know in yeah. the comments below. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, if you'd be uh, interested in volunteering to take a couple of these um, to the chest, then, you know, we'll do it. So. Um, all right, well, yeah, like I said, so pepper ball, this type of, type of stuff's been around for a long time. It's just usually been kind of reserved for law enforcement, military, you know, retired cops, things like that. Uh, but yeah, as of, uh, you know, recently, it's been something now that's readily available to consumers. Um, so yeah, we'll crack these open. So, um, cool. So kind of, so the background on the pepper ball stuff. So people always ask, like, you know, you know what's in it what um you know that type of stuff so pepper ball rounds um they're actually considered like a food product uh the live uh ingredient in this is a uh it's from a pava pepper i believe they call it mm. uh yeah pava yep a pava a pepper powder which is approximately two percent live uh so the, yeah this actually comes from a food extract so that's where uh, it originates from i'm gonna open one Ooh. <laughs> be careful yikes open one of these two so you can see so these are 68 caliber uh, rounds you can shoot them out of any normal paintball gun and just put some out there for you guys to see um, so any pack it's going to come with uh, two five round tubes you get 10 rounds total uh, retail price on the rounds is between 20 to 25 bucks uh, so obviously kind of expensive uh, but hopefully you'll never even have to use these uh, that's you know Always a hope with any type of home defense, you know, firearm, non-lethal, anything like that. Hopefully you're never in a position that you'll ever need to shoot one of these. So hopefully you just spend 20 bucks, 25 bucks, and uh, you never have to fire them and everything's perfectly safe. But if you do need to use them, it'll definitely be money well spent. Um, so how these things work, if you can uh, kind of see them. So the shells themselves, so the pepper ball stuff is actually made by First Strike. Um, that's one of their, you know, separate companies, divisions, uh, however, you know, the legal's written out, but they're kind of hand in hand. Um, so the, the shells are actually a double-sided first strike round. So usually a first strike round, it's just going to be, you know, this, this, you got your center seam, the top half of course would be the plastic. The bottom half is that fin that everybody knows. Uh, so the pepper ball round is just an entire uh, first strike shell. So one of the benefits to these is that they are impervious to anything that the first strike is, a wa you know, water, uh, dirt, moisture, all those things that normally gum up a paintball that, um, you know, will make a paintball not shoot. Uh, that's what these things will not do. So which is uh, pretty cool. So they can get wet, they can, you know, do any of that type of stuff and they'll shoot perfectly fine. Uh, they say the shelf life on these is about two years uh, two years long, so after two years you might want to shoot them or replace them. I mean, they'll probably work. I would even think for forever. Um, the first strike rounds, usually what they say is it's uh, typically just the light that breaks them down. So I would think it might not be necessarily that the shell is going to go bad in two years, but the potency, the potency of the, of the pepper, pepper will decrease. So the guy will only have a slight sneeze if you shoot him after two years <laughs> instead of a full on. Yeah. So uh, yeah. So you might yeah you might want to swap them out. Uh, you can always test that theory after a couple years is up. <laughs> shoot it and see. Maybe you do you know you know do do one now one two years later. <laughs> there you go. Yeah, let us know too. Make sure you email us if you. To compare and see so i'm definitely gonna be excited to go outside and shoot these see how it works but uh they're intimidating with that red shell yeah actually you hear them clinking together they kind of sound like marbles 
Yeah, no, that's yeah, that's for sure. So, uh, like I said, so these can shoot out of any 68 cal paintball gun. Uh, if you had the money, I mean, you could easily fill up a hopper with 200 rounds of them. I mean, that would probably be about 400 bucks to fill your hopper, but <laughs> could imagine, could not imagine unleashing 200 of these things at once. That would be uh, a bad time for somebody. <laughs> that'd be a bad time for anybody within like a mile. <laughs> that would, yeah, that would be crazy. But yeah, so you can hear these things popping around. So when they hit somebody, it's definitely going to hit with a thump. I mean, you got your gun chronoed at 300 feet per second and I'm sure if you're using for home defense, you can crank it up a little bit more. Uh, they even make some special like home defense uh, version guns, like home defense only that you can't even use at a paintball field that shoot at even higher velocities. But yeah, you crank one of these out at someone, it's going to sting. Have we ever tested to see if the first strike shells in general are more brittle and break easier or are they a little tougher to break than a traditional paintball? Like a I mean, we haven't done, I, I guess, an official stress test per se. I mean, not my first inclination would be, yeah, they're definitely going to be, you know, I know guys that play first strike are like, no, it doesn't hurt anymore. It doesn't hurt any. I mean, I would have to imagine that the shell is probably going to take a little bit more to crack. I mean, just due to the fact of the material that it's made out of. I mean, it's impervious to water and things of that nature. So I would have to. I would to, just hate to shoot uh, something I mean, with I'm one squeezing, and then find out it doesn't break. Squeezing that. Pretty hard, yeah. I mean, this is the. I mean, this thing. I mean, I'm not speaking to first strikes. You know, those might be formed, but I mean, these things are. I mean, I'm squeezing this pretty hard to the point that. Okay. There's no. I mean, I'd have on the package that say like you should shoot this at a 300 velocity or. No, no, it's got just kind of your basic, you know, re warnings, recommendations, uh, legality stuff. You only have to be 18 to purchase these. Uh, there's no background checks or anything like that. Uh, there are definitely restrictions, though. Uh, they can't be shipped to California, New York, Maryland, in the District of Columbia. Uh, so if you live in one of those states, unfortunately, we will not be able to ship these to you. Um, but uh, cool. So I'm going to actually show you um, the TPX kit. So I know I mentioned we're doing, uh, we actually have these. Like I said, we have a home defense section on the website now. You can search Pepperball. Um, and then we're putting together some bundles. The first one we did was naturally the Titman TPX. So we have a bundle on the website for $275. It'll get you the Titman TPX. It comes with two magazines, uh, seven round true feeds, one already in the gun. Second magazine comes with all your parts, barrel cover, you know, your barrel plug. Um, and then included in the kit, we will be including six 12 gram cartridges. So you can mess around, you can shoot it with some normal paintballs to practice, and then you'll get a uh, 10 count of the pepper ball round. So 275, normally the gun itself is a $250 gun, so extra 25 bucks, you're getting a whole set of the pepper ball rounds, and you're getting six cartridges, so you got plenty of air. So that's an option. Uh, we're gonna add some other stuff too, like your Titman TP, uh, Titman TMCs with the air through stocks. Those are a really great option for home defense. Um, you know, give you you know the you know the realistic rifle feel with the little tank in the stock. Uh, the TPX pistol is obviously a great option um, again for the home defense route. And like I said, though, you can shoot these out of any paintball gun you have. You can throw them in an R2 and feed them into your you know <laughs> CS2 and <laughs> you know have a have a day at it. So, <laughs> but uh, cool guys. So like I said, this was kind of uh, an overview of the new pepperball rounds that we're carrying. Um, this is an option. Um, now that you can uh, you know, purchase them through the website, home defense kits, TPXs, magazines, rounds, cartridges, buy whole bundles. Like I said, we'll be adding some other, other guns, uh, other tank options to come in bundles. Anything you want to see, let us know. And uh, yeah, most importantly, uh, definitely can't wait to shoot these. So stay tuned for a follow-up video to see how they perform outside. And don't forget to go to the Jerky Den, get that lean protein, keeps you full all day on the field or on your couch while you're watching our videos. And give me one second, we will have a comment for Joe to answer from the YouTube. Do, 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 do. So, uh, two, three. Uh, all right, well, here's one kind of relevant to us being local uh burrows lawn boy chirps wants to know is the shop open for air and paint 
Uh, yeah, so we are open now. Uh, now that you guys are uh, seeing this video, uh, curbside pickup has been allowed again for uh, retail stores. Uh, we've been shipping online orders the entire time. That hasn't been an issue whatsoever. But uh, yeah, so uh, currently today is April 30th when we're shooting this video. So yeah. we are open now. Rules could change. Uh, hopefully we're not going to be taking a step backwards. So, But yeah, we are open for uh, paint and air. So uh, give us a call. We'll do curbside fill up. You just uh, drop your tanks off in our enclosed vestibule. You head outside. We sanitize them, fill them, and uh, leave them out there for you to pick up. So. And the outdoor, the metamorph field is now open for play because by the time yep. this comes out, opening weekend will have already happened yep. with the new rules. Uh, and there either was already a video discussing all the new rules or it will be coming soon depending on which order these come out. So look for it or stay tuned. Thanks, guys. Take it easy and shop at LomoPaintball.com.